So my name is Ian McLaren and I've been um, living and working in Moreton Bay for 30 years. So um, I've had a long association with the local area. I guess I would describe myself as a, an illustrator. I do a lot of drawing, so that's really my main focus. And I, I paint in oils. Um, I do a lot of work on paper. So I keep visual diaries, you know, most of the time as a sort of a, just a record of what I'm doing. So the last two years we've, we had um, an exhibition at Pine Rivers Art Gallery uh, called Fresh Eyes. For that work, I created a series of um, works on paper called Mosquito Island Series. So the whole concept of that is that I live in, right on the mouth of the Caboolture River. So my view out the front of where I live is Mosquito Island. So it sounds like a really uh, not inviting place, but I actually find it really inspirational because it's something I look at through my window every day. So it's my muse, it's, it's, you know, it's what I see in everything in the background of what I'm doing. So when we had the the lockdown, I had a, all good intentions of going and doing grand works in the landscape and sort of painting in the mountains. And But what happened was we got locked down. So I had to sort of stay and, and just go, oh, well, what am I going to do? Look around my my house and my yard. And so that was the work that I created um, from the the buildings and the, and the views and the things that were in my backyard. Within the work, there were a lot of emotions and I guess if it was a no novel, the work would be a psychological drama because it became almost a struggle to get through the year. So I guess the thing with the work is it's got isolation because I was stuck at home. Anxiety because, you know, we didn't know what was going on. So there's a certain, there's a certain uh, element in the work which I think it's slightly gothic because it's got that um, what's going on, you know, what are we, what are we going through here? I think if you look at the work, it's like a series of tiles and it's basically a, a, a timeline. But when you randomly put the works together, they sort of work off each other. So hopefully I can get, you know, record the, the, the moment, which is the last two years and people can, you know, sort of scan the images and sort of maybe get a feeling of just what and where I was at the time and how I was sort of um, responding to our, our you know, recent times.